gotta be something different. You must be made for me. What's up, y'all? If you want to learn how to remove darts from your skirt pattern, keep watching. If you don't already know how to draft your own skirt pattern, check out my how to draft a skirt pattern video that I have linked above. Let's get to it. The first thing you're going to do is trace out your skirt pattern onto another piece of paper. You want to make sure that you're transferring over all of the notches, transferring over the darts, and transferring over the hip line. After transferring your pattern, you're going to take your ruler and draw a line from the tip of the dart and you're going to draw the line all the way down into the hem of the skirt pattern. Next, you're going to slash into your pattern the opposite side of the center and then you're going to cut around the dart. For example, this is the back pattern. I'm cutting opposite of the center back. So you don't want to cut the center back off of the pattern. You want to do the side opposite from that. And you're not cutting straight through the dart, you're cutting around it. After slashing through your pattern, you're going to place it right on top of the dart and overlap it. Then go ahead and tape that down. You're going to repeat the same exact steps for the front pattern. So again, I'm drawing my line from the point of the dart all the way down to the hem. And then I'm going to be slashing the opposite side from the center front. And now we'll be overlapping the dart with the other piece and I'm just going to tape it down. Now that you have both your front and your back piece, you're going to tape those pieces down to another piece of paper. So essentially what you've done is shifted the fullness towards the hem of the garment and none of the measurements changed. Everything will still be the same besides all of the fullness that's at the bottom of the garment. Just taking my Sharpie and I'm just filling in that gap at the bottom of the hem and I'm going to do that to the front pattern as well and then I'm going to cut my pattern out. When I transferred my pattern over initially, seam allowance was already included into my garment. Now that I've altered both the front and the back piece of my pattern, I'm going to go ahead and cut it out onto the fabric. When it comes to cutting the pattern out onto the fabric, you're going to cut it out like you normally would. You're going to have two opposites for the back and then you're going to have one piece for the front and that's going to be cut on fold. So the cutting and everything else is still the same. And then um, you're just gonna take your pattern to your sewing table and you're going to sew it per usual. And after sewing it, you will see that you have an A-line skirt. And that is it for the tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section. Bye.